Well, welcome back to my channel and thank you guys so, so much for tuning in. For those of you who do not know me, my name is Mandisam Fazong and darling, I'm about to be your favorite YouTuber. So, whew, let me just sit here for a minute. I just got home. I just arrived in Johannesburg. Um, I haven't been here. <laughs> wow. I haven't been here since last week, Monday. Today's Tuesday, the 30th of April. Um, I was home all week, had stuff to do at home. So yeah, I'm back. Um, I'm noticing things that are pissing me off. <laughs> because my helper came on Wednesday, I think. So I let Chantal open for her. Let me just open it. And like, I don't understand why, but she put the blinds down. But like, my guy, why? Like, why? This is the way it's supposed to be. Duh. Like, does this make any sense? And now, obviously, you like bending my blinds, bro. But okay, that's not the point. Can I just give you another egg? <laughs> As I was saying, my flowers are blooming, guys. My boyfriend got me this plant. Um, I know this is not a pot, a what? A pot plant. It's my bowl. <laughs> Mixing bowl. But anyway, my boyfriend got me this plant. And I asked Chantal to water these flowers while I'm away and it seems like she did because they look so cute! Yeah, my boyfriend made me a plant mom. Also, I don't understand. One, oh guys, I swear I'm done complaining. One last complaint. My helper was here. I got these flowers two weeks ago. Or was it even more than two weeks ago? Miss Girl decided that she's not gonna throw these away. What? Anyway, this is our outfit of the day. So, um, this is my airport fit. Just having black leggings from Cotton On. I have these Puma sneakers on. I don't know what they're called. I got them when I turned 21. <laughs> um, this coat is from Zara. This t shirt is courtesy of my boyfriend. I don't know. It's his top. I stole it. Because what is the point of having a boyfriend if you're not going to steal his stuff? But anyway, I want us to do... I had to pick up something from DHL on my way here. And then I also had another delivery. Can I put you guys like here? Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Um, so, this is a delivery that just arrived actually. It should be here from. I think it's Ali Pearl. Oh, shit, I cut the wig bag. Yeah, Ali Pearl. They sent me this unit. So, we are going to be doing a hair video this week. Can you see how big this t-shirt is? <laughs> Nick. <laughs> anyway. Um, so, yeah, they gave me an HD lace cap edge brush like you know i the way i'm so spoiled with these hair companies my edge brushes like i throw them away when they're like too dirty because like i have so many and lucky you now my lips are dry i have like so many so there's no point to like keep all of these things but i do give them away um lashes which i'm probably never gonna use probably should close that door so sorry for the background noise 
Aw, a mirror. I hope. So cute. I, oh, it's a pom pom. Period. So cute. Don't you wish your girlfriend was hella me? <laughs> My favorite thing from a wig company, a uh, melting band. Because washing melting bands, I hate it. What is this? Is this like those tape stuff or fat hadian? I don't know what this is, but it came in the wig bag and there's like a little bit of elastics. Agbietni. And then this is their pre styled wig. I thought it would be longer. It wasn't just the 26 inches. Oh, it's a pom pom. Period. So this is the wig. I don't want to take it out of the net, but oh my god! Are you mad? Okay, Ali Pro. Can you see how bleached the knots are? Sana. Okay, this is nice. Ish 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 when. This is nice, guys. Wow. I think it's about 22 inches. Yeah, it's about 22. Because I don't remember it being 20. Wait, man, here's the packet, dumb fuck. Yeah, it's 22 inches. 250% density. Thanks, Ali Pearl. So, yeah, the wig video. For this is coming up soon okay hey Ewena. wow i think like i want to do this on friday maybe sooner we'll see what is today tuesday ha <laughs> my flag was actually yesterday morning and then my man was like can you change can't you change your flight it was just a question, but I took it as me definitely changing my flight. Okay. Next up, we have what I got from... What I was... Yeah, what I went to get from DHL. So, this package was supposed to arrive in Kimberley last week, right? Um, of course it didn't. Because here it is. So basically, the Sunday, not this past Sunday, the Sunday before that, I think like the 20th or I don't know, those kind of dates, I went to Gucci to go get new stockings, right? So I just want to say, if you want to buy Gucci stockings ever, if you don't have, just know it's going to be something that you are going to be buying over and over and over again. Because one thing about those stockings, they will tear hair. I actually want to show you. So then, okay, basically they didn't have them in stock, but they said to me that I can order it online and it would arrive in Kimberley in three to four days. Cool. Three to four days comes, goes, hmm, didn't arrive. So I arranged for them to drop it off at a pickup point to the side because it was already too late. Whatever. Very pissed off at Gucci though. I spent 5k on stockings. Well, again. At this point. And I didn't even get them. Oh, what I want to show you is that they were actually torn, but you just won't notice. Mm. These are mine. Like, I don't know if you can see. You see there by the G, it's torn there. Um, I don't think I stood in a way that anyone could see, but between my thighs as well, it's torn. So I was like, yo, Jessica Morana, I'm just gonna try and figure it out, hey? Yeah, those big torn parts don't really show. I had to maneuver these stockings so like the torn parts don't show. 
because you see even here so I had to wear my old torn stockings to the tombstone but you know what I maneuvered it I made it at the end of the day that's all that matters but so here are the new ones I actually would like to return them but like it's pointless inside I was wondering but anyway here are the damn stockings the stockings come with why is there so many stockings okay is this a letter to apologize for being late Thank you for shopping with us on Gucci.com. We hope you enjoyed your experience. No, they lied to me and said it would arrive earlier than expected. Or well, not earlier than expected. Well, not. It arrived late. So, but this is cute. Um, yeah, this is cute. This is not necessary, but they gave me this. Okay, maybe I'm going to start buying from Gucci online. Because they give more things like Honali di letter, Honali di bag. There's things, man. This is the DHL Customs Clearing Instruction. This is the invoice. Yeah. Oh shit, that's a thumb for this is the. Okay, guys. These are the stockings. Maybe I won't Re take them for a refund. I don't even know why I'm unboxing these. There's nothing to write home about. Oh shit, I should have taken a picture for my thumbnail. Diezas, Tandwilson ish. But again, the smell of new things just make me so happy. So these are the stockings. I took a medium. Well, obviously, you'll be able to see when it's like on me. I took a medium this time. My previous ones are a large, but they were big. So, this is gonna work, hopefully. So, yeah, that's all the unboxing I have to do. To oh, wait, there's one last thing. It's just your baby earring. Um, so. Yesterday I was at the car wash uh, in Kimberley and Mpo Asakai came along to come drop off Acha and then we were like bro we also want and like there's nothing like Kimberley Acha guys like I can't wait to show Chantal what I got us so Momo's Munch Rocks Homestyle Mild Acha so excited um yeah i literally carry this in my handbag <laughs> so if you can really like a um i think this is the 50 rand one because she said there was an 80 and a 50 one so she gave my boyfriend them the 80 one and i took the smaller one because i mean i'm just one person so yeah i'm gonna can you see my suitcase is still standing there i'm gonna pack out I'm starving, I need to eat. And Keleta Borotadli Acha Witigini. Pretty Russian. Oh my god. Let me call Chantal, guys. I haven't seen my cousin in a week. I missed her so much. So yeah, I'll speak to you guys a bit later.
push that five for you I do that three, four times again, I testify for you I told I like you, that bitch I do it All that I'm around, you scared to do I'm not, as long as you joking, now it's for me I ain't got it, poppin', skimmin', looting, hide your body As long as you dreamin' about me, ain't no problem I don't got nobody just with you right now But the truth, I look better under you I can't lose when I'm with you How can us lose and miss the moment? You just too important Nobody to fight it like you do I can't lose when I'm with you I can't just lose and miss the moment You just too important I'm tired right with you, I feel like Scarface Like that white bitch with the bob, I'll be your main one Let's take this argument back up to my place Sex with my girl, I'm not violent on you day one We had shit, yeah, it was magic, yeah Smash and grab shit, yeah, nasty habits take a hold Good morning, sweeties, welcome to the next day Um, so, wait, um uh, I just woke up, it's like half past eleven um, I just, I don't know, I was doing like, you know, the whole, I wanted to speed up the whole morning thing. And when I was about to start my Bible study, I was just like, why do I not like involve you guys in it instead of you guys just seeing me do it. And explaining what I do, because it could help the next person. So, I'm not consistent, I'm not even going to lie, I'm not consistent with Bible study. But this is the way I do it. So basically, I use the Holy Bible app. It's this app over here. The brown Bible app there in the corner. Can you see it? They're next to Zoom. That's the app I use. So they send me um, a verse of the day every morning at 5 a.m. When I do not have time. Or I don't feel like, I don't even have to say time, when I don't feel like actually coming to the desk and doing all of this, I like would just listen to it and go about my day. But there are times when I feel like I want to do this and I'm trying to become consistent. Today is the 1st of May, it's Wednesday, but it's the first day of the month and I think in order for me to get into the habit of trying to do this every day, the first of the month is the best time to start. You know what I'm saying? So like for example, today's verse of the day is Amos. I've never even known that there was a book in the Bible called Amos. This is news to me. Um, it's the New Living Testament, verse 5. No, chapter 5, verse 24. Instead, I want to see a mighty flood of justice and endless river of righteous living. So that would be the verse of the day. So I would listen to the guided scripture where like the guy speaks for like two to five minutes. Um, also go through the guided prayer, but then on my own, I would go into the Bible, my actual Bible. This is the New Living Testament. I feel like the New Living Testament works for me because why English, like English that I understand, and Hasibudi thou art how how wah wah. No, no man, where nah. So I would find the verse in the Bible, highlight it, um, read around it to see or like see what it is about or where we are because sometimes we can be so lost in the Bible, like you must just read this thing and try and understand, but that also. That is why this app, I like it because they have the whole guided scripture thing where the guy actually explains. And then I use the SOAP method of Bible studying. I learned this on TikTok. So basically, SOAP stands for scripture. Can you even see? But the S is for scripture, O is for observation, A is for application, and P is for prayer. So your scripture is obviously your verse. So this is the way I do it. Don't read my writing and stuff, but like, this is the way I do it. And so your scripture would obviously be your verse, your observation is 
what you observe, what your observation is from this verse, your application is how you're going to apply it into your life or how you're going to apply it into your life. And then a prayer for that sums up your whole entire verse or your understanding of the verse. And I feel like this has helped me understand more and not just read a verse and like keep it moving. So that works for me, and then normally the next thing I do is I journal. So the last time I journaled was the 1st of February. <laughs> and Bona, there has been so many updates in my life since then. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to do what I gotta do and I'll speak to you guys when I'm done here. Um yeah happy workers day I'm unemployed <laughs> so I'm not a worker <coughs> so it doesn't apply to me but to those of you got a personal number today's your day sweetie <laughs> My lips were so dry because I didn't touch like, anything of the brush in my teeth, but you know what? Hi Yala, can you see me? It feels so weird, but the lighting is on that side. I can't put you guys here because then I'm dark and the cupboard is here. <laughs> the cupboard is here, so it's like just weird and awkward. So like this is what we're gonna do, like a mara mara situation. Blah blah blah. So basically. I want to show you guys how I refresh my install. So I want to hold a yo, hold up, hold up. Let me show you guys like this. We want to like, it's bad, you get. So I'm gonna show you guys how I fix this without like having to re redo my hair. Do you get me? I feel this is very weird for me. I can't. Mm. I can see myself from this angle, so when I when I wet there we go. So this is your hill, holy grail, okay? Don't say I don't plug you, but this is your holy grail to just like get a clean canvas, like that's the purpose of it. Oh, by the way, guys, I'm going. Chantal's taking me out for lunch, <laughs> so that's why I'm getting ready. I just come out of the shower. Then come how it's on. So we're not combing out the hair, but we are just like trying to push all the hair back. Shwena. I wanna push all the hair back nice and neatly. Wow, like can you see my hair? Do you see I have a wig line guys? It's so embarrassing, but I don't care because I'm not gonna wear anything else but wigs, so it's a me problem. If it bothers you, get a ewa. So I'm just trying to make it look seamless. But you get the point of what I'm doing. I hope you do. I just need to see because I really am blind as a bed. Oh, I want a clean canvas then. And so we don't want to get rid of the edges, of course. So let's bring it forward. Throw it now. There we go. Okay, we might as well because this needs to be pulled. <laughs> But yeah, this is from Exotic Hair Boutique, just by the way, it's the Malaysian Curls. Absolutely love it. So right now we're not focusing on like any of the edges. Our main aim right now is to re-secure this lace. I think I installed this hair like on Sunday. Yeah, on Sunday. So, glamour. 
the holy grail. If you're not using Glamour, get with the program. Leave that yellow can alone. I believe in Glamour, Glamour, Glamour. And then Obuiri. Elastic band, lace band, whatever you want to call this. As tight as you can. So I do want to say that we're going to do this probably like twice. Not probably, we are doing it twice. Why am I lying? So, while that dries, we get into these dry as curls. This is not a vibe. Obviously not. So, two sections because it's obviously always easier to work in sections. And let's wet this baby. This is just plain water, no additives. My hair still smells like smoke from friday i had this hair on on friday i actually got this hair installed on wednesday then i took it out saturday morning because i needed straight hair for the outfit i was wearing and then i reinstalled it on sunday um but anyway my hair still smells like smoke from friday night because i was at my girlfriend gig and and there was like fires big black pot but when i like divide it say well so i still smell like fire smoke not fire why am i saying fire i smell like smoke but you know what when i stop wearing this well when i decide to uninstall this hair which will be in this week then i can wash it and then we'll be great again so i'm using this brush i got it from I think I bought it from just Kim here. I have one. I'm sure I have two or three maybe. But I saw a black one and I'm like, sign me up. I like black things. I don't like the color color. Like, I like it. Can you guys hear that phone ringing? Like, that's the, like every 30 minutes of my life. I don't know, is it my next door neighbor or is it someone upstairs or what? But their phone rings like that. But Igariki, maybe it's a house phone. But who still has that? Is that even still allowed? What's a. Um, and if you have knots, like, instead of like just like trying to brush it all out and fight with your hair, don't do that. You're gonna like cause unnecessary shading. Locate the knot, like, take out that piece alone and try and detangle it just that like curls are obviously going to tangle it's a you see like there's a knot there somewhere so what you do is just that part alone and then you minimize the shading and all of that because as i was saying curly hair is bound to knot up and tangle and stuff because it gets dry and like just the way it is Next up, we're going in with a special feeling gel activator. Um, shiny, well-defined curls and waves. Ugh. Ish, don't take so much, ne? <laughs> this was a lot. Because I actually, I'm not going for the wet look. I'm also not going for the dry look, but... So obviously it's gonna need to dry because like this is not the vibe. But I'm gonna do the other side and then I'll be back. Okay. Okay. So my curls are defined. I like them when they get dry, but like they're still gonna low key look like this, but then they're gonna be dry and like shabam so anyway this sh should be ready now and this is how i take off instead of like taking plucking it off i like stretch it off and then it like just seamlessly comes off so i wanna 
first step what secured step two <laughs> now this is step three at this point um edge brush dirty dirty edge brush that is hard very important oh yeah so I spray it with this spritz what what. This is uh, holy grail. If you don't have that, go buy it. Two days still okay. So obviously remember that your lace is not completely dry because we were not drying. I mean we were not like at the end, we were just trying to secure the lace so that we can do all of this. So can you already see the vision? Oh, no, bona vision, no matter. Buena. Buena, buena. The only part that I don't know what to do with is like these edges here. Hey! Shabasin. Buena. Good. You can't join my table. So now it's time to direct these edges into the right place. Yeah, I'm like I'm too lazy to go fetch. I'm too lazy to go fetch glue. So I'm gonna spray my edge brush. Gel, not glue. My edge brush with glamour. And then we are going to swoop. And I promise it like it actually works. When are you not with us? Why does this one wanna be with us? No. Get your own mate. Baba? Hey, where nah? And then this is always a problem because it always lifts the lace always hell oh you see lace lifted but let's try and do something with it i don't know i need to go closer let's do that hole and the mirror thing maybe let me zoom you guys in yeah i think it's gonna work now I can't see myself. Yeah, this is Shone. Magubanjara Sana. Bana, we are not acting as if it were installation, yeah. But we are just touching up. Oh. So. So that's about the side, and then I'm gonna do the other side because I don't want to waste your time. I've been here for a bit too long and you know, talking too much. So let me do the other side, and then we're gonna spray, then we're gonna secure, then I'll come back and show you guys how the finale looks. So I wanna like get out of and how finale like this whole situation. Oh, elegant man! <laughs> Bye. You're born a namdi teacher, so now what? Ha 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 ha! I'm the teacher, Gog. What? <laughs> One thing about me, I can beat my face to my liking. Well, I have nothing on my lips yet. Hmm. How about now? It's giving. Day vibes, we're gonna be easy, the shanties are really easy, baba. Like, it's your sense, we're gonna. Like, I discovered a new whole eyeshadow look, so you guys probably know I'm gonna be abusing it. But, Nditi, Namdi teacher, son. Hi, Namdi teacher. So, I went to go do my face because I FaceTimed Chantal. And then she had a face beat, and I'm like, I'm not going in here with this dry ass face, the fuck. So, I kept this band on way too long. I hope, like. 
you know like this is the most nerve-breaking part about installing your wig like we can all act igari ready teacher but all need hi namdi teacher fuck all that shit i was saying Bona. um It's just here when I live in Buwait. I'm going to go to Buwait. It's an okay, but... Other than that, you know, I'm going to teach you how to go. See the hair's dry. How lovely. Curls are defined. Yeah, no, I don't even know what I'm wearing. To be very honest. It's like, I'm going to go to Buwait. I don't like it. But let's try the hacks that people do. Okay, it seems like it's working. So I'm just putting on this thing on my finger and tapping on the white spots. But other than that, I'm gonna let this get me down. The hotter, the fabulous time to look for an outfit. Um, I like that it's not cold in Joburg, so I'm just tightening this thing. <laughs> I like that it's not cold. So I can get away with wearing in. Oh, nah! Sonsi gets a picture of because the girl I'm seeing there, the girl you guys are seeing, eight. Let me find out what I'm gonna wear because I really don't even have a little bit of an idea. And then I'll be back with my outfits and then we can go for real now, I swear. Okay guys, I'm finally done. Um she my outfit. No. Well, as per usual, I'm wearing <laughs> the only piece of jewelry you'll ever see me wear is a watch. It's a fossil watch. Uh, fun fact, I don't even know how to tell time. Okay, maybe I do. But, like, I need to focus. Like, no, you're not. That's one, that's two. That is five, ten, fifteen. So it's like 21 minutes past two. With my Period! <laughs> so it's just the fact that I need to focus that, like, pisses me off. But anyway, let me show you my outfit. This is this. So I have on this top. It's from Shein. I got it like a long time ago. I have on these jeans. They from Cotton On. I think this is probably the second time in my life that I wear these jeans. The first time I wore them was the first time I bought them. They're not like nice and stretchy and friendly. And also we have the whole waist thing that's a problem because Renale Magaho hate that but anyway then I paired it with these pink Zara heels the reason why I'm wearing heels like I'm not even doing anything hectic today but because you can see where these jeans end like the air bottom basically I'm short for the damn thing basically and if I don't wear heels, it's going to be on the floor and I'm going to look stupid and give us a whole look at here now. So yeah, I'm going to carry this DNG bag because I'm wearing a white top and I just feel like light denim white bag makes sense. Um, for my fragrance, I'm going to use this Versace Crystal Noir. Um, I think I told you guys about this in my Q and A. And then I'm gonna go in with this. I don't know. Is it Orb Rubens? Um, I got this as a gift because wearing one. Smelling like one perfume is overrated. Basically, do you guys know that we can all like just become 
Like, what do you call people that make perfumes? A tubali. We can all become them because I really don't know of people that still be using like just one scent. So we mix and mix and mix and then everyone says, oh my god, this smells so nice. So basically, I'm the teacher, So yeah, anyway, for my lips, I'm just gonna put on a glass. If I can find the damn glass, maybe. But yeah, so that's the outfit. I'm gonna pack my little bag and then I'm gonna go down to Chantal because she's having an outfit malfunction. Swear so y'all. The lighting is actually so nice here. Not on the Who comes it so much? Hey, woman. Is it skew? Anyway, my outfit looks so nice. These curls, can you see what I was referring to when I said like I want them to dry but not like dry in a defined Bona man, I'm the teacher. I've been saying Okay, shit, I think I've said that a lot But like it's my new saying thing and not like, deal with it So you see the outfit makes sense with this like hectic wig So yeah, the hair's from Exotic Hair Boutique do not sleep on these curls. I think this is 28 inches or is it 30? I don't know. But that is why I'm wearing this jean actually because my hair is so long that it can cover that part. Wobble. Look at her. Look at the woman, man. Look at her. That ain't my. That ain't my. That ain't my girl. That's my nigga. Catch me out. Oh, can I get my dress up, man? I can't. I just want to Savannah. <laughs> Hey guys, I know it's like dark and like it was here, but um, lunch was. Lunch is not really lunch in it, let's just be honest. I feel like on the net, health and more streaming. True. Life is vibes. Also, why are you not. I want to delay it more. Yeah. I need to tell you. 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 Exactly, we're having serious what? chats, guys. And also, I wasn't home for a week, so we were catching up. So, like, hmm, sorry, but anyway, we're on our way to we're on our way home. Um, in 600 meters, turn left on Coleraine Drive. And then, anyway, we're on our way home, but like my hubby stove blew up last the last time I was home, so we need a hubby stove because now I'm going home to go cook because I have practice asana for when I am a woman in the ring industry. Oh, so yeah, practice for after lunch. Woman in content. <laughs> For <laughs> <laughs> after the lunch, really the girls, so it's like, hey, give me a bye, Baba. Do you not say what? Yeah, actually, I'm just really starving, and like the food wasn't banging. And Turn left on Coleraine Drive. I really want my chicken curry like right now, so that's what 
time I go make. But I can't cook without knowing her. It's a whole kaka habli, maybe in Wadi, Savannah City, 6, 12, blah, blah. You know what I mean? So, yeah. Just a little update. I think we're almost at our destination. Can I come on? If I had eight minutes and then we'll be there, we'll be like a happy stove and then we'll be on our way home. Lipstick, Yaga? Hmm. Really? It, it was there like uh, before uh, I even got to 1962. <laughs> <laughs> Bona! My, it's my, 19 on 4th, girl. 19 on 4th, yeah. But it's 1962. Okay, 1962. We'll return 1962 more podcast. <laughs> and I swear to God, guys, like, oh, we're, not, we're so, tell me, we are so sober for these funny Too things. Bad. Sis. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, shop. Kitla Bula Lilina when I get to my place. Hey, anyway, hi guys, I'm back and I'm back home, and as you can see, we are about to start cooking. I'm not gonna take you guys with along with me like that because I'm working on a budget. Not budget, time budget. And I gotta go see my man. Hey guys, welcome to the next day of the vlog. Um, I just woke up. Well, not really, but I wasn't planning on getting out of bed today. But but I got woken up by a delivery. And the reason I look like this is because I was crying like an idiot. <laughs> because like I'm gonna cry again. It's like it's just so crazy how like people 
come into your life and like or rather how you pray for certain things you want in life and they come exactly the way you wanted it like that's so crazy um like surely this is nothing big for anyone but like for me this means the absolute world and I've actually been crying guys like I'm not even joking like oh my god so I was with my boyfriend last week well, the whole of last week and Monday and I was telling him like how winter is approaching I have an electric blanket at home but I don't want to take the electric blanket at home um, because when I go home in winter like what must happen now electric blanket i need a gas heater because bloody place is big and the tile so it's gonna be like really cold i need a mat and a table a coffee table like i need to finish this lounge area so that it can become cozy and stuff for the winter because it seems like it's gonna be a very cold winter hey sorry my nose i'm so sorry so I woke up very under the weather today and was crying anyway this morning for like my own stuff. Like I was just, I don't know, I just felt that like life is not lifing anymore and like, yeah, it's just one of those mornings, one of those days. It still is, but like this really uplifted my spirit even though I look like a fucking flu. But, hey... <laughs> Just let me show you. Well, I get a call. My boyfriend calls me and he's like, there's something at the gate for me. So he knows I'm not okay. So I was just like thinking, mm, maybe send me flowers or whatever. And like, I need to get out of bed for flowers. Like, cute gesture, but like, bleh. you know what I'm saying? Like, because... <laughs> It's all cute and nice and like, you know, whatever, but like, I'm sorry, flowers are really not gonna like uplift me right now, you know? So I was just thinking about that while I was getting dressed to go downstairs. Hmm. Let me show you what this guy got for me. So this man got me a gas heater and um, uh, electric blanket for all these details. Like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> what like I never asked him to buy me these things I genuinely did not ask for anything I was just telling him about all the things I need to do before June and like this is what I'm this is what I've always wanted or this is what I meant like I want a partner that builds me not bold. Yeah, bold's me, but like... <laughs> I don't know, guys. Like, what? I'm crying for a gas heater and an electric blanket. Like, do you understand how serious this is? Like, life is not always about, like, these stupid gifts. Like, bags and designer and, like... Like, things with purpose. Like, there's so many things I need and want and... <laughs> Like things that are gonna grow me, you know? Next sharper bag is gonna look cute on me forever, or for as long as I have it. But like, I don't know if you get what I'm saying, trying to say. I'm just like everywhere right now emotionally, and like, I just can't believe this. Like, what? Funny enough, I was looking at this gas heater like two weeks ago on my current, I'm like, oh. I think it's like 1.7. Okay, you're not supposed to check the price of gifts. <sighs> yeah. But anyway, I'm gonna end the vlog here. Like, I just. What? And like, when I call him and say thank you, he's like, yeah, so we just need a cylinder. We? Oh my god. He said we just need to get a cylinder and. This really is crazy. It's crazy how 
you can pray for certain things and God will give it to you like in a short period of time it's absolutely crazy but anyway I hope you guys enjoyed this short vlog um, basically why I decided to pick up the camera when I arrived in Johannesburg now the other day was just because I feel like I've really neglected you guys and you guys probably hate me and even if I'm not doing anything I can't pick up the camera and invite you guys for two seconds in my life because I think that's what you guys would enjoy so comment down below if like this is what you guys want it doesn't have to be a week vlog that's an hour 30 minutes every time sometimes it can be a two-day vlog it can be a day day in my life vlog it can be you know as long as i'm inviting you guys into my space i think we can agree on that but tell me in the comments what you think do not forget to like comment and subscribe love you guys loads Anna. yeah no i'm on to one with each other Hi. He <laughs> showed me everywhere. He's the teacher. <laughs> I'm always saying that I'm the teacher. I'm not, bro. Like, and it's so hard to surprise me. I'm not the one to be surprised or get surprises. No one really surprises me.